Hey everyone! In this video, I will show you how to import a custom email created in Postcards directly to Salesforce. First, open the email template in the Postcards app and insert all the required tags by Salesforce. I have inserted the tags here in the footer module. These tags will be transformed automatically in a readable text after you upload the template to Salesforce. Also, I have added preferences and unsubscribe tags. Export the created template and open the archive. Add images to Salesforce. Open Salesforce and click the Files item located on the menu, which is where we'll upload our images. Click the Upload Files button and choose the desired images. Images are now hosted in your Salesforce account, and you can use them. Next, we'll start to create our custom email template directly in Salesforce. Click the Settings icon and choose the Setup item. The Setup page will open in a new window and choose Email and in this drop-down menu and then select Classic Email Templates. OK. Here we'll store all our custom email templates. Let's create a new template. Click the New Template button. Choose the Custom option and click Next. In this page, select the Available for Use checkbox. Write the email template name. In the encoding drop-down menu, choose Unicode UTF-8. Also, you can write the description and subject of your email here. Now, click the Next button. For the most important step, I will write the subject, and I will copy and paste my HTML from the index.html file. Open the index.html file in a code editor, or text file, and change the directory of images. I want to insert new URLs to images uploaded on Salesforce. First, I will change my logo. Here is the logo image. Open the Salesforce page with uploaded images and click here to create a public link to this image. Click the Create Link button and copy the created link. Open the link in the browser. Here is our image. Now I will copy the direct URL to this image. Right click the image and choose Copy Image Address. Now, we can paste the copied URL here in our code. So, the image will be loaded directly from the Salesforce server. Remember, you can host images in other places. For example, on your server, or Amazon SES. The important step is to change the direct URL to image in the code. I will follow the same procedure with the rest of the images. Find the image in code. Create a public link. Copy and paste the URL in the code. Move forward with the remainder of the images from our footer module, and I will change all the URLs of these images. OK, the code is ready. Copy the entire code and paste it in the HTML body. Click the Preview button to check the template. The template looks good. The images are loaded. The tags will be changed to readable text later. I will show you a test email for this. OK, save the template and let's send a test email directly to my inbox. Click the Send Test button and choose an email. Click the OK button and let's check the result directly in my inbox. Here it is. I received the email exactly as I built it in the Postcards app. You can see that the tags transformed into readable text. The email looks good. Let me show you how to send a campaign directly from your Salesforce account. Open Salesforce and click the App Launcher button. In the search field, write Campaigns and click on the result. Now click the New button and write the campaign name. Click the Active checkbox and Save. In the right sidebar, click the Email tab. Here, we'll set up our campaign and choose the email template. Click this button and choose Insert a Template. From this drop-down menu, choose Classic Email Templates and click the previously created email template. Done! The email is here. Now, you can click the Send button and your campaign will be sent to your chosen contact list. We have finished this tutorial. If you have questions, please put them in the comments below. See you in the next tutorial!